Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. Bold and beautiful exclusive, Tanner Novlin braces fans for an explosive confrontation and the end of a dangerous cycle. As one bold and beautiful marriage begins, another appears to be nearing the end. Though Finn meant to really meant to stay away from Shyla and Deacon's nuptials, he wound up in the wrong place at the wrong time. If only El Giardino's specialty pizza wasn't so damn good. Now. Oof. The eye dose that Finn once exchanged with his wife are starting to sound more like, Welp, we did. Steffi's hard line woke Finn up, Tanner Novlin tells Sobs.com. He doesn't choose to attend the wedding of his murderous biological mother, Tim, and her ex-con fiancé, but circumstances prove otherwise. What's more, when faced with a choice, take his pizza and run, or stand by mommy dearest, he makes what he hopes is the decision that is the lesser of two evils. He knows he should just turn and go, but at the risk of setting off Shyla and by letting his big heart lead with supporting the prospect of Deacon and their marriage and helping her stay on track with her reform, he stays. Finn might want to keep that information from Stephi. He has to know that displeased won't even begin to cover her reaction. But of course he tells her, Novlin says, despite the fireworks that are guaranteed to ensue, Finn doesn't like or intend to keep things from his wife. And that impulse, however honorable it may be, is what makes the Monday, May 27 episode so explosive. Steffi hits the roof and keeps right on going. As the actor sees it, his character is stuck between a rock and a hard place. Steffi and his family will always be Finn's no, one priority, but he is working to sort out these feelings of supporting Shyla and her reform, he explains. He knows Steffi is sensitive to anything related to Shyla, so he is communicating these feelings as delicately as possible. No mean feat, that. Upon Shyla's resurrection, Finn imagined that perhaps he could have a relationship with his biological mother, them, that didn't in any way impact his relationship with Steffi. Originally, I think that's what he hoped for after finding her alive, Novlin says. But he is seeing now that isn't a possibility. Rightfully so, Shyla takes advantage of Finn's compassion. If only he could see that. Though the doctor remains blind to his monster's manipulative nature, he knows the longer this goes on, the more of a wedge there is between himself and Stephi. He doesn't want to risk damaging his marriage, but he wants to keep them safe from Shyla and support her, he adds. He knows how she reacts when she is completely shut out. It's been a dangerous cycle he wants to break. Through this impossible time, and it's only going to become more difficult. Finn has had hope to lean on and confit in. Because she has also worked through the reform of her dad, she offers a good sounding board for him. Novlin observes, they definitely have become closer through this. It has been nice for Finn to talk through his issues with someone who's been there before. Is that all that's going on between Steffi's husband and stepsister? Or could there be growing feelings just beneath the surface? If there are, they are one-sided, Novlin suggests. I don't think he sees anything more serious than friendship. As for Hope, I can't say. Considering that by the end of the week, Steffi and Hope have declared war, and Hope has already threatened to get even with Finn's wife for sending Thomas packing, anything could happen. And if we were the betting sort, we'd wager that it probably would. Asterisk asterisk bold and beautiful exclusive. Tanner Novlin braces fans for an explosive confrontation and the end of a dangerous a cycle asterisk asterisk. The sun hung low over the horizon, casting a golden hue across the sprawling Los Angeles skyline. Tanner Novlin stood on the set of asterisk, the bold and the beautiful asterisk, his character Dr. John Finnegan, poised at the precipice of a life-altering moment. Behind the scenes, the atmosphere crackled with anticipation as the crew prepared for a scene that promised to be nothing short of explosive. Novlin, known for his intense portrayal of Finn, the beloved physician who found himself entangled in a web of love, betrayal, and redemption, took a moment to reflect. The journey his character had undertaken was not just scripted lines and carefully choreographed scenes, 
It was a deep dive into the complexities of human emotion, raw and unfiltered. It's been a roller coaster, Novlin admitted with a reflective gaze, his voice carrying the weight of countless hours and delving into Finn's psyche. Playing Finn has been a privilege, an opportunity to explore the depths of love and loss and to confront the darker aspects of human nature. The upcoming storyline promised a crescendo, a culmination of tensions that had simmered beneath the surface for months. Finn, caught in a whirlwind romance with Steffi Forrester, had faced trials that tested his faith, his resilience, and his capacity for forgiveness. Now, standing on the brink of a confrontation that could change everything, Novlin's portrayal hinted at a character poised for a transformative moment. Finn's journey has been about growth. Novlin mused, his eyes narrowing thoughtfully. It's about confronting the past and finding a way forward, even when the path seems obscured by shadows. The scene in question was set in the tranquil gardens of the Forester estate, a stark contrast to the emotional tempest brewing between Finn and his nemesis. As the cameras rolled, Novlin stepped into Finn's shoes with a quiet intensity, his every movement a testament to the emotional turmoil simmering beneath the surface. Finn is at a crossroads, Novlin revealed, his expression betraying a hint of anticipation. This confrontation isn't just about resolving conflict, it's about breaking free from a dangerous cycle that threatens to consume him. The chemistry between Novlin and his co-stars was palpable, an alchemy born of shared dedication to their craft. Jacqueline Massins Wood, who portrays Steffi Forrester, brought a fierce vulnerability to her performance, her eyes mirroring the tumultuous journey her character had embarked upon. Working with Jacqueline has been incredible, Novlin admitted with a warm smile. She brings such depth and authenticity to Steffi, and it pushes me to explore new facets of Finn's character. As the scene unfolded, tensions escalated to a fever pitch, a symphony of emotions played out against the backdrop of swaying palms and fragrant blossoms. Novlin's portrayal of Finn navigated a labyrinth of conflicting emotions, anger and compassion, hurt and determination all woven together with a thread of unwavering resolve. For Finn, this isn't just about winning or losing, Novlin explained, his voice resonating with conviction. It's about finding the courage to confront the truth, no matter how painful it may be. The confrontation reached its zenith, a torrent of words and unspoken truths echoing through the tranquil gardens. Finn stood his ground, his voice steady despite the storm raging within. Across from him, a figure emblematic of past mistakes and future uncertainties met his gaze with equal parts defiance and remorse. Finn's journey has taught me a lot, Novlin confessed, his tone reflective. It's about embracing vulnerability, acknowledging flaws, and striving for growth, even when the road ahead seems uncertain. As the scene drew to a close, a sense of catharsis hung in the air, a fleeting moment of clarity amidst the chaos. Novlin, ever the consummate professional, lingered on set long after the cameras had stopped rolling, his thoughts drifting to the profound impact asterisk, the bold and the beautiful asterisk had on its audience. This show is more than just entertainment, Novlin emphasized, his voice tinged with reverence. It's a mirror that reflects the complexities of human relationships, the triumphs and tribulations we all face.